Tell me about how you think about preparing your students for the future. I know in my group, we away from skills line, we do a lot of scenarios. So one of my lessons was you're answering the telephone at the company. And maybe you're not even the receptionist, but you're the one that was closest to the phone. So in the scenario, you had an angry customer when you picked up the line. And there was like a little script about what the angry customer said. And I hear kids, oh, Lord, that sound like they were listening to my mama. I recognize that our kids' examples are not the best out in the world. But as a teacher, I'm just trying to show them there's always a different kind of way we can present. I can still call your company and be upset because my equipment is not working. But there's a way to say that. That's right. Getting to the outcome, like what are you trying to accomplish, I think is a big part of that too. Like it doesn't help you to get, do they think about those sorts of things? The emotional regulation, it doesn't necessarily help you get to the outcome you're looking for, right? Oh, get mad. Or- that's why I just keep wanting you to know because you're not in the classroom that the things that your company is putting together for teaching the skills is like more valuable than gold because kids need somebody to show them 